I just want to bring you up to date uh, on the death of former One Direction star Liam Payne. Well, we've got some breaking news. Let's go straight to Daniel Henry uh, in London, and he can bring us up to date. Uh, Daniel, just bring us up to date on the latest with the death of uh, Liam Payne. Thanks, Nauda. We understand that three people have been charged in connection with the death of Liam Payne, the One Direction singer-songwriter uh, who died while in while he was in Buenos Aires uh, on the on the 16th of October. Um, we understand that the charges relate to abandonment of a person followed by death supply and facilitation of narcotics. Uh, the, we've got a very short statement from the Argentinian prosecutor here saying that Liam Payne was not fully conscious or experiencing a state of noticeable decrease or loss of consciousness at the time of the fall. People will remember that uh, in the middle of October, Liam Payne uh, was over in Argentina uh, visiting, uh, watching uh, a, a, a former bandmate, uh, Niall Horan, who had been performing in Argentina uh, earlier that month. Liam stayed on uh, after that performance and uh, went to Casa, uh, Casa Sur in Buenos Aires and sadly never came home because he fell from the third floor of a balcony there and uh, did not survive uh, the the injuries. Three weeks on from that from that death and uh, all of the outpouring of grief that we saw in uh, in Argentina and around the world, we now know that three people have been have been charged in relation to uh, the death of Liam Payne.